A defiant Texas Governor Rick Perry had to get fingerprinted and posed for a mugshot today in Austin. This is after he was indicted last week on charges he abused the powers of the governor's office. More on this story from NBC's Chris Clackham. Texas Governor Rick Perry had no choice but to be booked Tuesday in Austin on charges of public corruption, but had choice words to describe the charges. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fight this injustice with every fiber of my being. And we will prevail. A grand jury indicted Perry Friday on two felony charges of abuse of power for allegedly intimidating Democratic District Attorney Rosemary Lemberg into resigning after she pled guilty to drunk driving. Her arrest and booking caught on tape. You've been arrested for DWI. That's y'all's problem. Prosecutors say Perry threatened to use his veto power to withhold state funds from Lindbergh's agency that investigates public corruption. When Lindbergh didn't step down, Perry vetoed the funds. Well, I think it is a valid argument to say uh, it's a dangerous territory to indict a governor for exercising a veto or for speaking freely about a political issue. Uh, on the other hand, I think the prosecutor's argument is equally compelling, so it'll be a very interesting Perry's in the final months of a historic 14-year run as Texas governor and is said to be eyeing another run at the White House, provided he's not hurt politically by these charges. Chris Clackham, NBC News. And Governor Perry's first court date comes August 22nd. That's next this Friday, excuse me, though he does not have to be present for the arraignment hearing.